I'm Dave, and I'm Pete, and, and you're, you're watching, watching Into, Into the, the Studio. studio. to the channel i'm dave and i'm pete and today we have another ivy now the last ivy we had was what that semi hollow les paul style yes and people have been asking for this guitar and, and it only thinking. comes in green uh but they i been got it for this i beat him to it yeah i beat him did. to the punch yes he did and it's green green is my color um i love it i do this is this thing sounds great yeah it sounds cool it's the this is so it's got it's a it's a, it is an actual flame maple top on here you know and i like the one thing i like about the ivies they're putting good quality into a cheaper build absolutely and they're getting good quality builds out of doing it the binding the binding is done really nice it's a mahogany body uh it's a mahogany neck the the fretboard is actually our back to our buddy J Jatoba Jabata however you want to say it we're gonna make a sandwich of Jabata bread but the nut feels like bone the tuners yeah are, there was no info on the nut and they're unbranded tuners I yeah believe. they're unbranded tuners but they're very smooth they're not you know you don't get the kinky kinky sticky sticky whatever the case may be with some of them um, it does have the Les Paul style bridge the pickups. I, the pickups are really nice on it. Yeah, they I like are, them. They're, they're the Destiny wound, they're CNC wound, but they're like uh, Ivy's Destiny brand, and they're actually really good. I like them. They are, and the body itself is actually CNC machined. Is it? Yeah. So, I mean, and again, they're putting in excellent quality. Now, this is, it looks like a two-piece, because you can see the, you can see the line here. Yeah. Okay, so this is all one. The back is actually green, and I don't know if the camera is going to do it any justice, but this green is absolutely gorgeous. Oh yeah, it looks like an emerald. It does, and I there's it's probably no, emerald green. It is emerald green, actually. <laughs> Obviously. Hi, <Hey>, like, <laughs> leprechaun wanting the Irish, huh? Um, no scarf joint on here, which I really like. The inlays, everything is done perfectly. The the action, that action's nice. It's only about a sixteenth of an inch, maybe, maybe a little more. What I like too is they didn't copy like the Gibson style uh, knobs. They look from from here. They look like the Gibson style top hats, but they're actually like a UFO shape. They come up like this and go up. Um, they don't follow like it's not supposed to be a Gibson copy which I think is cool that a couple of other things are of their own. I mean, the body style is very similar. It's a Les Paul shape. However, you know, there's a hundred different Les Paul shaped guitars out there. Yes, there is. And what's really cool, you can see where it's raised, but it actually has a dip right here. Well, that's the carved maple top. That's, I mean, I, that's what Les Paul's like. That's one of the things that they're known for is, uh, that's why if you get like a Les Paul Jr., they're just flat. They don't have a carved top. Well, this was $200. Okay, so for two hundred bucks, right in the right in budget friendly, it's worth saving up for. This is something that you can buy and enjoy playing with. It is a set neck. Um, the electronics seem okay to me. Yeah, I yeah, it doesn't had, seem bad. I haven't had any problems. If you they're distort not, it, it sounds good. If you play it clean, it sounds good. And they're not loose, like the pots weren't loose or anything. No, nothing's the pickups there. Pickups are in very well. Um, we're gonna have to do a comparison with the Firefly. Um, unfortunately, I think that the Firefly is going to crush it, uh, but it is what it is. The, the Firefly, Firefly is not going to crush this. Well, just a AAA flame maple top. The things that come with Fireflies, I don't know how they're, 
I don't know how they're charging so cheap. But the Firefly, I think, was two eighty nine. So you're paying almost a hundred dollars more, I believe. Uh nah, dude. I don't think. We'll see. I don't think so. I think this is going to take we'll it hands see. down. Yeah, we will see because we're going to do a shootout. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. <laughs> and the green guitar is going to win because do you know why? Do you know why? Why? Because it's green. Geniuses pick green. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, who who made that up? Geniuses. I'm not sure who made that up. Probably somebody that scored very low on their IQ test, and they're like, geniuses. Pick well, me. we didn't say you made it up. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. I'm listening. The only thing I'm hearing is a bunch of black. As blah, long blah, as it blah. was bigger than my shoe size, we're good. It was, yeah, by, you didn't it was even, by one. Uh, no, no. They were nice to you about that. That was the day that the, <laughs> the easy guy was there. If the, if the real guy was there, it would have been, yeah, you're just this side of handicapped. No, because I, I told them I have strawberry-flavored windows. There ain't enough crayons or coloring books to figure this one out. You're right. <laughs> anyway, I like, I really like the white, well, the off-white branded. Um, yeah, the off-white color on the on the green rings and on the. Uh, I would get rid of this. I'm gonna. I get think rid that of this. would look so much better without it, just because with all that green. I think it, I think it actually takes away from the guitar. It does, and I always take the script, the pick guards off. I don't. I'm not a big fan of pick guards, really. I think they're just kind of like a. I'd probably even get rid of the poker chip. That's they call that a poker chip. Who calls it that? Poker players? No, that's just what they call it. Like if you go to order it, what from Gibson? It's called Who's a poker they? chip. The guitar community. No. Yes. The Dave community. No, it's called a poker chip. It's not called a poker chip. It's called a Pete chip. No. Yes. No. You know why? Why? Because it's on Pete's guitar and Pete can call it whatever well, Pete wants. We'll take Pete's chip off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But if you look, I mean, really, like, take a take a look, like, from this angle, right? And look at You get rid of this and you get rid of this with all the green. Oh, yeah. I think it's... And with the gold, I think it's going to look great on there. I really wish they would have matched the colors, you know, with the, with the tuners and that. Although... Well, this may be a project. Uh, it, it's not. Yeah, it may be. Maybe. Even if you look down here, it has the. That's you can tell it's wood. You can tell it's real. This isn't printed. I like this guitar. Yeah, it's nice. The binding's done. That neck is comfortable. It's tapered real nice too. You know, like. Yeah, it's it, got like a speed tapered neck. It doesn't feel like a Les Paul with that brick. This is. That's where it's gonna. That's where it's gonna beat the other one. Maybe. Yeah, we'll because in, in neck and sound, sound alone, it's going to kill it. I don't know. Those those pickups in here are pretty good, so it may, yeah, tone wise, it may be it may be a little better. Oh, it's the same thing in Leo James. So, but Ivy guitars are. Yeah, I wonder if they're made in the same factory. Uh, that's a good question. It's possible. We're going to have to look into that. It's possible. Possible. Yeah, that's French for possible. Yeah. Well, I mean, as long as it's not Upid's Day, that's Pig Latin for stupid. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, well, let's plug her in. Let's check it out and uh, let's hear how she you? sounds. Are you not paying attention? She already plugged in. Oh, okay. Well, let's hear how it sounds. Okay. All right, so now we're going to go through all the pickups clean, and then I'll go through them dirty. Um, the clean, I'm using no effects whatsoever. You're hearing just the guitar itself. Um... I, you're not going to be disappointed. Dave's going to be disappointed when he tries to put the firefly against this. But you're not going to be disappointed. Okay, so that was clean. Um, now I'm going to add some effect to it because everybody wants to know what they sound like dirty too. You know, a lot of people like to get heavy, so that's what we're going to 
throw the effect on. All right, so here we are, nerds.